Hello everybody and welcome back. We are here in the Fens of Nassar. The last time we were in this zone, we were working on some Bathazid faction for our trade skilling. Well, today we are going to work on some Relis faction. That is actually the faction I would like to work on mostly. Uh, I have done that in the past and it was very enjoyable. Uh, the Bathazids is, is, is good for, for the trade skill half, so I'm going to try not to do any quests on the realist side that is going to majorly impact the other side. Uh, so as far as I know, there's only one quest we're going to work on today that would do that, so I may not even do that one at all. We shall have to see. I would like to ask if you do enjoy my channel to please subscribe. And also give me a like for the videos that you enjoy. It does help to grow the channel, and I do appreciate it very, very much. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Now, we are going to quest today over on Sather Span. We're going to start there. And that's going to give us quite a bit of realist faction. In fact, each quest that we do, we should get about 2,000. So that's going to help us a lot with them. Now to get over there, we just need to ride the Soka car. Hello! I'm going to try to do these quests without Kel out. And if it's too much of an issue for me, then my mercenary will be joining us. Oh, I'm looking forward to questing in this zone. There's a lot of quests here. Now we have already been to Sather Span. Uh, if you recall, when we were working on the crafting, we brought a package out this way, and we were told to come check back when, uh, when we were ready and there could be more tasks for us. And as I look around, I see that that is the case. Um, I do want to pick up any collections that we find. There are some important collections that if we come across them, I will mention them. Now this gentleman over here, Captain Zillix, now he's the one that will give us a quest to kill the Bathazid Outriders. So that's going to hurt that faction. And I don't have enough faction with them uh, to be able to risk it at this point. So if you don't care, this guy right here has a nice quest for you. So let's start over on this side. Hello, Trader Dustier. Hello. I don't have time to talk at the moment. If I do not concentrate on what I need to do, then my life may be forfeit. Oh, well, what is it that's going on? Well, I suppose at this point, there's little hope anyway. A few minutes likely won't make much of a difference. I guess if you're going to be nosy, I'll humor you. Indeed. So what is it that you has you so worried? To be brief, I made a lucrative deal with one particularly ill-tempered necromagus from Rillis. He wants the buds from some kind of animation experiment. I wasn't really listening to the details. All I know is that he was willing to pay a lot for them. Okay, please continue. Anyway, I found that it wasn't as simple as searching the swamp for their buds. Apparently, the frog biters keep their buds with them. And getting close to one of those things is not something I am able to do. I nearly lost my head just getting close to one and was chased from the swamp. They can be quite dangerous, that's for sure. Well, you know, it doesn't matter. You appear to be equipped for combat. Hmm. Perhaps you might be interested in a lucrative deal yourself. I'm listening. I suppose you're looking for someone to gather those buds, correct? That's correct. 
If you can gather me a good pile of those frog biter buds, I will give you a percentage of what I was going to be paid for them. I think this deal works out well for the both of us, wouldn't you agree? All right, I will go do that, but I expect a generous payment. So we're going to get this quest. It's going to give us 2,000 faction. Now we only need to kill eight of these frog biters. Uh, so we're going to go out and do that real quick. I am going to uh, fly in this zone. It'll just save some time for us to get to the areas we need to get to today. But what you want to do is you want to come down the ramp here. And you want to kind of hug this wall. Because the rock biters... There's one straight ahead. Let's see how we do with them. Oh, I think we're going to be fine. He was my level also. So we just want to run around here and just kill eight of them. Oh, now that's a 73. Now there's a lot of other creatures in this area. And it might be quicker to just pick up every quest you see if, if you want to just zip zip through. Oh. You want to check each little area. They could be hiding behind rocks. There's another one right up here. That over there is a subverter. Now, he's not aggro to us. It's probably from a different quest. done with that. So we need to go back and turn that in. Now right here is a camp. This is the Western Pins. And uh, there is a Soka car here. Take a quick ride back to Hello. Satherspan. Greetings. Well, I've been waiting for your return. Did you find what you were looking for? Indeed I did. Here here are the Nasarian frog biter buds you wanted. Fantastic. So now we've got some faction with Rilis. Wonderful. This should be enough to save my hide. I'll take this to the Necromagnus immediately. Thank you for your help. Here's the payment you were promised. Farewell. Thank you. Goodbye for now. Sure, we'll be speaking again. Now we're going to come and speak to Penkeeper Valjic. And these must be my ancestors here because uh, they're frog locks, yet they're not as intelligent. The jumpers grow restless. If the patrols do not return soon, 
we may find ourselves fighting off some angry froglocks. Oh, these right here? Are they in danger of escaping? Perhaps you should have a fence up like a gate. Oh, not immediately, but I fear they might attempt to do so before the patrol sent to the pens returns. If that were to happen, then all on the bridge would find themselves in danger. Oh, yeah, that, I can see that could be a problem. Well, what is it that you're waiting for? Oh, they're, they're meals. We feed them a stew that they find irresistible. And up here on the span, we have run out of the mixture we need. The patrol was to bring some back, but time is short. Oh, well, I'm here looking for work. If I were to grab the ingredients, I might be able to help you. Oh, perhaps. Um, however, you must be very specific in what you get. If we give them the wrong mixture, they may not eat it, and we will be no better off. Okay, well, I will do my best. What is it that you need? Well, we will need parts from the giant insects that inhabit the Swamp of No Hope. First, we need the gooey innards of the dragon hawks, which you should be able to find buzzing the swamp. Also, look for the carrion recluses found near large rocks in the swamp and bring me their soft segments. Finally, we will need speckled budlings from the mushroom colonies you find. Oh, mushrooms? What are those for? Well, they are the sedative for the mixture. The mushrooms weaken the creatures, making it impossible for them to leap from their pens, such as this one. I don't need much of the mixture, maybe enough to make a few bowls. Um, find what I need and make haste. Okay, I will get that. Another 2,000. So, the first thing that you want to get on this quest is the mushrooms, because those are the most difficult to find and could take the longest. And what you're looking for is you want to start way over here, as far over as you can. Uh, and what you're looking for is these groups of little mushrooms like this. Only around the bottom, sometimes there is a little different looking mushroom. And that's the mushroom that we need for this particular item. So I'm just gonna look over here real quick. I don't see anything. So we're gonna head on back this way. There's one. Looks like this right here. And we need 10 of those. And that's why it's important for you to start grabbing them. Now, once you harvest them, you will not be able to come back and harvest it again. So uh, we need to make sure that we don't miss any in the area. They can be a pain. Oh, these right here, these carrion recluse, that's what we need also. Now, if you'll notice, even if you have EQ2 maps, it's not going to tell you the areas where everything is. Uh, it's going to notate where there might be some mobs that you may need, like these right here we need.
these flying insects over here are the dragon hawks that we need. There's another pin over here, so we are going to get this dragon hawk and head on back. And once you find your way around the swamp, it's nice having these uh, soka cars here because you can quickly get to a part of the swamp that you need so that you don't have to uh, well met. run it every time. So this is the eastern pen, so now we've we visited both, but we're going to go back to Sather's. Most of the quests starting out here are really fairly simple. But they give a lot of action, which is nice. It's not going to always be the case. There's going to be some quest lines that we do that uh, give very, very little faction. There is that. I'm back. Hello. Oh, I suppose you're looking for some kind of compensation. Here. This should cover your time and expense. Now, if you'll excuse me. Oh, by all means. I still think a gate would be a great improvement. So we've already got those two done. Now we're going to come I'm going to come over here. I'm going to see what this person wants here. This researcher Teski. Hello. Have you seen the Yale down by the lake shore? Vile as they might be, they do have an interesting talent. They seem to have the ability to manipulate the water of the lake itself. Oh, is that so? Well, how do you know? I have been down there. I saw their creations. They look like elementals, but they're composed of the water from the lake of Ill Omen itself. It's indeed a thing to see. Huh. Continue, please. The outriders of Bathazit's watch do not appreciate intrusions from my kind. Although I can certainly fend for myself, I cannot spend the time to gather the information I'm looking for if I have to stave off attacks from the enemy. Well, I can see that. What is it that you're looking for? Well, I want to know how they're manipulating the waters of the lake. I if we, with our advanced knowledge of magic, could do the same thing, then no enemy could stand before us. Imagine having the power of the lake of ill omen at our fingertips. Well, that certainly is ambitious, ma'am. Uh, so what's your plan? Well, perhaps you can help me. You might have an easier time getting past the outriders since you're not a Relician. Would you agree to help me if I might pay you for your time? Well, I can certainly be persuaded if the pay is right. What do, you, what do you need? Oh, excellent. Now, I need you to confront the Hydromancers. They're the ones that have the sumlings with them. You're looking for any kind of a magical component they might possess. I do not care 
how you go about getting the items. Just bring me some samples of what you find. Okay. But have your purse strings ready and open when I get back. <laughs> I'm not going to do this for nothing. Oh, we're going to get a lot of uh, faction, but I'm also going to get this earring, which is an upgrade. Fantastic. So we need to collect four solid bubbles of water. Now that doesn't seem like a whole lot. There's another quest here that has us looking for something else. Let's see what this guy needs. Keep jumping, Swamp Seed. It is so brave and adventurous, I seek. Well, I'm brave and adventurous. I've already proven that. Huh. You've undoubtedly proven yourself useful to release. Uh, yes, but have you heard of the new invaders on our lands? Looking for volunteers to help deal with them. Now, just how venturous do you feel? Well, well, I could probably do it. What is it that you needed? Now, this one is going to only give us 500 faction with Relis. But we're going to take it because it's not against the Bathysids. So... Persistent at the least. Good. Then I will trust you with this one task. There have been reports of invading scouts lurking at the edge of the Swamp of No Hope. They're encroaching upon Sather's span and must be slain. See to it. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and do this one real quick. It's really close by and it's not going to take that long at all. Uh, what you want to do is come over here, climb up on these rocks, and the guys you need are right here on the other side. So they are close. That's why Sather Span is so nervous about them. So we're going to go ahead and get this done real quick. Now, because we killed that one, whatever our faction standing with the Order of Rhyme could not possibly get any worse, which we don't have faction with them. So, uh, yeah, there's that. But some people may have started quest lines for the Order of Rhyme before you get to this area. Uh, so just keep that in mind that this quest may affect that if that's something you need to keep. Okay, we only need one more. That looks like our target right over here by this tree. that one. So I'm going to go back. All right there, Revelis. It's done. 
You have returned from the hunt. If it is in failure, then I will be using your flesh as a sheath for my sword. That's not like that, sir. I remove the scouts like you want it. Then you have returned with honor and proven your skin hard and your bite strong. Thank you. So he wants us to find more camps. I'm not going to pick that one up just yet. I'm looking for the other one that will send us to the area where we have to get those water, bubble waters. Um, let's see what this one needs. Lore seekers. Zest Greetings. I have a proposition for you. How would you like to be a part of history? Interesting way to open a conversation. <laughs> what do you have in mind? Well, I'm not sure how much you know about the history of Lake of Ill Omen. Have you ever heard of the city of Vexar? Although it once was a grand and beautiful Ixar city, it now rests at the bottom of the Lake of Ill Omen, as it has for many centuries. Oh, okay. Continue. During the Age of Turmoil, Vexar was rediscovered, and many of its riches were plundered by the adventurous and greedy. After the Age of Cataclysms, it was lost again, reclaimed by the lake during the unforgiving flood. Oh, so it still rests on the lake bed then? Perhaps. Perhaps it also was simply obliterated. Who can really know? as none have reported ever finding it again. However, what is interesting is that evidence of Vexgar's existence occasionally washes up on the shore, perhaps as gifts from the lake. Oh, indeed. Have you found any of these? I have. Rarely one will come to my attention, and I'll study it as best I can, but I need more. I want to prove that Vexgar still sleeps under the water and that she still has treasures. Okay, well, how are you planning to go about getting these pieces? Well, that's how you become part of history. You see, the Yale still swim within the waters of Lake Yaomen. Perhaps reaching the deepest part of its waters, it's possible they might bring up larger pieces of the city itself. So you want me to search their camps to see what I can find? Yes, yes. Bring it to me. Okay. <laughs> I trust there will be good pay for this, or I won't be handling over what I find. I'll, I'll see you soon. And that is what I wanted to pick up. These fragments of Vexgar are going to be over near where these solid bubbles are. So what you want to do is basically come back down on the other side and follow this wall you can jump it you don't have to fly it but that way you miss any of the mobs and because we have somewhat of a faction with the bathizids they're not as dangerous to us as they would be See, he's not even aggro to us. But if we had done that quest that I pointed out at the very beginning, this is who we were supposed to kill, then we would have issue. So it's just how you would, would like to, uh, to have it play out. Now, I am going to go to that piece furthest over on the left there and start there, uh, see what I can find. And you shouldn't have to go in the water for these two quests. These platforms should work. And I'll show you what we're looking for as far as the fragments go as soon as I see one. Now, do you see that Yale Hydromancer over there? That is who we want. Uh, I don't want to get the uh, Outrider involved. So I am actually going to pull Our first these over of here. The day.
the waves take me. The waves take me. Okay, and you, what you want to do is look around all of the items on the platforms for those fragments. They can't be anywhere. I don't see one on this one. You'll make a nice feast for the hatchling. And we didn't get any quest items. So I'm going to jump over to this next platform. I believe there's a fragment around some of these poles. So you also want to look. Nope. Okay. There's one. See this one right here? That's a fragment. So you want to collect. Our first catch of the day. Oh, he's who we need. Fantastic. The waves take me. There's another page. A loose page. Okay. You want to collect all of these. Because what they're going to do... This is page number 12. It is for the mysterious black tome. This is actually for a language quest. Then you want to go and speak to an NPC called Sethus Kai. He is on Sethir's ban. He's on one of the inns. He's going to give you a quest called Feathers for Sethus. And you're going to have to go and kill some of those birds, those, those turkey birds. And once you complete that, he will teach you the Sethirian language. So it's very important to get this one done. Now this language is going to be required for a, quite a few quests. It's also going to be required for uh, quite a few of the epic weapon quests. So it's definitely worth your while to get it done if you can. Okay, I'm still looking for... Here. Fragment. Our first catch of the day. Seriously, dude. The waves. Oh, there's a name over there. Well, yeah, we have to go get that. Okay, we got all the fragments we needed. Mergul. Water, grant us rebirth. Ooh, a legendary cl oh. That's an upgrade for sure. Sweet. Got a couple over here. You'll make our first catch of the day. The waves take me. The waves take me. We are done here. Let's go ahead and get back. Okay. I'm back, researcher. Got your uh, globes of water. Greetings! Well, Will, did you find anything that might provide a clue? Well, yeah, I believe I did. They had these solid bubbles of water on them. 
Might this be what you're looking for? Very nice work. I think you have earned your pay with this. I have much work to do, but if I need you again, I trust you'll be willing to help again? Oh, yes, of course you will. Okay, well, we'll see. Take care. All right, and we are going to go over here now. Lore Seeker, I have recovered several pieces of what appears to be fragments from the lost city. Nice. Wonderful. These are better than any pieces I've seen before. Perhaps with this evidence, I can convince Ryle and his advisors that an expedition to Vexar would be very fruitful. Huh. Well, you've done your job and may have earned a place in history. Here. Take this with my thanks. Oh, good luck with your expedition. Nice. Okay, let's see what Apprentice Trainer Hasika has. Good hunt to you. Excuse me. I'm wondering if I might take a moment of your time. Well, I have a few moments. What is it you need? I was given a task from my master, Trainer Solreg. I was to collect the Sokakar young from within the Swamp of No Hope. However, when I entered the swamp, I found the breeding areas of the Sokakar crawling with needle tails. So you weren't able to fend them off? No, I was not. I haven't seen them this close to the Sokakar before. And although they do not seem to be attacking the adults, I didn't see many children. I fear that the Needletails might be preying on the young they come across. So what do you want me to do? Well, I do not have the means to drive off the Needletails, and you appear to be better equipped to deal with the issue. If I offer you my pay, would you consider clearing out the Needletails? All of your pay? <laughs> Why would you do that? Well, it's more important to me that I do not disappoint my master, uh, rather than keep my pay, you see. If you would do this for me, I will give you what I have. Okay, I will get that. We need to go and kill 12 of those needle tails. Now, before we do that, I'm going to put on my new earring and my new cloak. Okay, now the needle tails, if you recall, were back over where we were searching for those mushrooms and those insects. And they were those big dragon looking things. So they're easy to spot and even easier to kill, I imagine. So we're gonna head over that way. some of those down. Here we go. You're going to find them down around where the water is. So I will be back well met. I must return to my master soon. Were you able to clear out those needle tails? I was. I have hunted down enough of the wyverns. Then I will go tend to my own duties within the swamp. I'll gather the young that I can find and return to trainer Solrig as soon as possible. Here, as I promised, I owe you my pay for your work. Good luck to you. Thank you. Farewell. Now, there's not much left here. Uh, there is one, I believe, down this way. Let's see what it is. Hello! Uh, threats to our city. Oh, the crystals. No, we're not going to do that one. 
Okay, so what we're going to do is we're pretty much done here with any of the quests that I was interested in doing. And if we look at our faction now, under Kunark, now we still have, we're still threatening with Bathazids, but they're not going to attack me. Sotherians still don't like me at all. But the Relist now are dubious. So we've put quite a, a good amount of faction in today with them. Now we are going to ride over to the next area that I'm going to quest in. Uh, so let's go ahead and get over there. Hail! And that is going to be the Relist Post. Head over that way. We're probably going to end up having to spend a little bit more time at the Relis Post than we did here, uh, which is fine. Um, there is one really nice item that I'd like to get from the post, and that is another mount. It is a Rhino mount. So we're going to be working towards that, but we have quite a few quests to do before we would be able to get that. Uh, but that is going to be the goal. And hopefully we'll be able to get that next episode. We will have to see. But this is the post here. And you can see by looking at the map, there's quite a few quests to do. Now, if you get your faction up with them, you can also craft here uh, and to get more factions. So, there's that. I want to thank you for joining me today. Please give me a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And hope to see you next time. Take care all. Bye-bye now.